Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Do you have to report workers' comp on taxes? Gen N Workers' Compensation provides benefits to employees injured on the job. These benefits cover medical expenses, rehabilitation costs, and lost wages. Workers' compensation laws vary by state, but the core principles are similar. Generally, workers' compensation is designed to assist employees without the need for litigation. And one critical aspect to consider is whether these benefits are taxable. The Internal Revenue Service, IRS, has specific guidelines on this matter. According to the IRS, workers' compensation benefits are generally exempt from federal income tax. This means that the benefits received under a Workers' Compensation Act or a statute in the nature of a Workers' Compensation Act are not taxable. NN, however, there are exceptions to this rule. If an employee also receives Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, or Supplemental Security Income, SSI, part of the workers' compensation benefits may be taxable. This is due to the offset rule, which reduces the SSDI or SSI benefits by the amount of workers' compensation received. NNI, it is important to consult with a tax professional to understand how these rules apply to individual circumstances. Tax laws can be complex, and professional advice ensures compliance and accuracy. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.